Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Melina and we are back with the 100 baby challenge. Tulip is pregnant, so we are just gonna hop right into the chaos. So we're most likely gonna have only one baby since we only have one household spot left. Is it a girl? Is it a boy? I don't even know. Let's see. It's a boy. I'm telling you guys, Tulip gives birth to a lot of boys. It's so different from Maya because Maya used to give birth to a lot of girls, complete opposite of each other. So names, I know I saw in the comments someone suggested noah and i thought that was a really nice name so if you guys want to suggest any baby names for girls or boys feel free to leave it in the comments so there we go we have baby noah oh perfect our cute little baby i might just feed noah for now just in case he is hungry or not but there we go also guys we have to age up michael michael why are you sleeping outside okay let's get a cake out and then we'll age up michael i'm actually really sad that we're gonna move out michael but he is a high school age student so make a wish happy birthday michael why are you sad it's a great occasion don't be sad we are moving you out but it's for the best i don't know where i'm gonna put him i'm hoping any one of his siblings houses are available all right let's see what your last trait is michael has some pretty decent traits guys he's a cat lover he's a green fiend let's see let's see loves outdoor michael has some really good traits that's really good all right let's see your aspiration is gonna be bodybuilder you know what we'll take it we will take it there you go michael i don't know why you're sad but you know what you're good hey but what happened to you oh my god are you good yeah use the bathroom please actually you know you need to eat please go i am gonna move michael out so give me a second i don't remember where anyone is oh this is a good house i think these are the recently moved out kids michael you can stay here i'm glad we have room for michael to stay at his sibling house come visit don't be a stranger all right we are not gonna waste time i met another wolf and i'm gonna call him over i am not shameless about it i'm gonna call him over right now it's 10 hopefully he'll come over let's put Cass in here let's put him to bed i don't think he's hungry he's just smelly oh well, okay he's a little bit hungry but let me just get to the pregnant first and then we will feed don't even worry Cass, and i will not forget about you this time is he here oh my god he is here oh why are all of the wolf like angry well let's just i guess we can talk to him a little bit affection hug maybe our love meter is not that high with him like we just started flirting with him so it might take a bit oh there we go a nice little hug oh what is she doing brag about baby oh is that the best i love his outfit though it's so cute oh my god okay all right where did you go what are you doing i was like what is he doing please and you know what let's just try to flirt let's try to flirt all right we're sitting down why didn't you sit near him okay i guess you wanted to sit on the rocking chair girl i told you tough flirt oh she's doing it right now how is he taking it how is he taking it yeah okay Ooh! wow another flirt i am so surprised whoa 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 <laughs> another flirt she's doing this all by herself that is so funny love that girl get it all right what else let's do like a pickup line do you like some pickup lines i feel like i'm so out of my element like we have not flirted in a while so let's exchange numbers then we can know if he's into us oh my god i just noticed he has glasses wait that's so cute all right let's see let us see if you guys don't know when they kiss the phone that means they're so into us yes he's into us okay love it oh my god she is just flirting by herself are you into him like really i have never seen her flirt this much by herself she wants to kiss someone i mean girl we can make it happen we can make it happen let's offer him a rose oh my god this is actually really easy flirting with him is pretty easy you go tulip no where are you going where are you going where do you think you're going we are not done talking with you please stay for a second we wanted to offer you a rose so please accept it and we stop Okay. <laughs> all right i guess so give him the rose is he gonna take it oh my god yes this is so cute oh my god can we like have our first kiss let's try it let's try it first kiss first kiss let's go let's go oh my god so cute so cute not me kind of liking wolfgang <laughs> the moment we've all been waiting for let's try for a baby please do not reject oh! 
Did you just reject me? Attempt mistletokus. I mean, I guess you literally just rejected the idea of having a baby with me, but you will kiss me. Oh my god, okay. Are you not ready for the commitment? Actually, we don't even need you to help us. We just need to get pregnant. All right, let's try again. Okay, please do not reject me. <laughs> I can't. Don't reject us. Where are you going? Are you accepting this time? Yeah, please, please leave, Abel. Are you accepting this time? Okay. Oh my god, I love the robe. I love the robe. All right, please tell us that you are pregnant. He just left, so I have to call him. Oh, yes. Okay, yes. I don't have to call him back. Perfect. Great job, Tulip. We love our fertile queen. All right, we're gonna have to take care of Tulip for a bit. Yeah, you're hungry? Yeah, go eat. Then you can shower and then sleep. Okay, what are my kids doing? Where are you at? Oh, you're sleeping already? Okay, you're gonna be hungry, so you can get some food. Have you done your homework? Do extra credit. You have not done your project. Oh, I'm thinking we can put his project up here somewhere that he can do his homework. Oh, okay, do I not have room? Okay, yeah, there we go. You can work on your project afterwards. There we go. Okay, Abel. Oh, he's in the treehouse. Did you do your homework? You did. Okay, he did his homework. Did you? I think he had a project that was inside the house. I think this is his project. I guess he didn't finish. So you can finish that. Also, where are you at, Belle? Cassid! Cassid! Oh my god! Okay. Oh, okay. Oh my god. I am so... Oh my god. I am so sorry. Cassid, please. Please. Get out of there. Hurry. Hurry. Please, hurry. What are you doing? Why are you stopping? Cassid is about to be taken away. I said I wouldn't forget him, but I did. I'm so sorry, Cassid. Cassid, I am so sorry. I said I wouldn't forget you in the beginning of the episode, and I forgot about you. But we are feeding you now. I'm gonna give you a shower. You know what? I'm gonna give you some special attention right now. I feel so bad. I keep forgetting about Cassid. I don't know why. All right, I think my baby's probably hungry, so I'm gonna have to go check Noah. Noah. Oh, yeah, I gotta go check on Noah. I'm so sorry, Cassin. I'm so sorry. Let me go feed your baby brother, Noah, and then I will give you a bath, and I'll give you some attention. Noah had a stinky diaper, so we are good with that. And let me just, okay, I'll cuddle you for a bit and show you some attention, and then maybe you'll go to sleep. I do have to give a bath for Cassin. I'm not gonna forget about him. I will check up on Belle for a second. Belle is eating. What do you have to do, Belle? Have you done your homework? You have not, so let's do that. Then also, let's put your homework out here. Let's put your project somewhere. I have no room for this project. Really? How about over here? I mean, you know what? Outside's not bad either. You can get the fresh air. You can do that. Where is my baby? Where is my baby? I can't. I can't. Are you feeding him? Okay, good. Did you guys see that? My baby was gone. It was gone. I can't. Good job, Abel. There we go. Why don't you go eat something and then take a little nap? Oh, no, Callie. I am so sorry. You're gonna need a bath as well. Finally, we're giving Cassin a bath. I feel so bad. We actually have to give Callie a bath afterwards because she's very stinky as well. But Callie, you can actually go to sleep for a bit. Oh, look at him. He looks so happy. I'm so sorry. Cassin reminds me of another forgotten child i forgot her name though oh quinn quinny i always forget about her so Cassin's like quinny and i feel so bad everyone is starting to head out to school bell's not in the best mood where is abel abel please where are you why are you still in the treehouse please leave and go to school that's a weird thing to ask zero honestly i thought he was already dead but i guess not no abel good job all right kylie let's get a bath let's get a bath and then we're gonna probably work on some skills with Callie. Also, some skills with Cassin as well. There we go, Callie. A nice bubble bath for you as well. I am not gonna try to forget your bath, but I have not been doing so well. So, you know what? You can't really blame me. There's just too many people in the house. No! Are you serious? No, please. No. She barely got a bath. Can you please stop? I mean, she looks kind of cleaner, but like, please put her back. Callie, stay put. Stay put. Please, guys, work with me here before Tulip passes out. Just shower her please oh <laughs> so random but no we're good callie please you don't want to take a bath okay you know what whatever i tried i tried callie you can go to sleep are we serious our power got turned off oh my god this episode i can't i cannot who what stop leave me alone i'm trying to pay my bills let's see oh my god four thousand dollars wow okay let's pay that i cannot believe you are still showering when the power is off please pay your bills <laughs> I always forget to pay my bills and then we lose power. Please pay the bills. Are we good? Do we have light back on? Please tell me we're good. Yes. 
Wait, Cassin can sit up now. Why do you keep calling me? What? Oh my god. We've been thinking about trying for a baby lately. Do you think we should do it? We want to, but we're not sure. It's a huge responsibility. What do you think? Jasmine has been calling me quite a bit in this episode. And every time she calls, I never get a chance to pick up. But this is why she's been calling. She wants to try for a baby. Yes, girl. Yes, try for that baby. All right, well, I think yes, we'll do it. Thanks for the advice for having a baby. Oh, that's so exciting, Jasmine. Cassin is actually sitting up by himself. So we can actually feed him some infant baby food. Oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. I do need to feed him. I don't know where she's going because he's starving. What are you doing? Why are you over there? Please feed him. He's starving. I didn't forget about you, Cassin. I know you were hungry and I'm feeding you right now. <laughs> I feel so proud of myself. School is out. B student. Oh my god, Abel. Oh, I thought it was a, I thought he was an A student. Okay, he's a B student. What about you? Belle, you're still a C student. Oh my god. Okay, you guys need to work on your homework then. Oh no, Eddie. Eddie, please. Did you see her? She looked at him. She was like, what are you doing on the floor? Oh my god. Okay, you can sleep. All right, guys. We got the twins working on their homework. One over here. And then one who was working on his homework. What are you doing? Abel, I'm gonna really need you to do- You need to do your homework. <laughs> yeah, get back there. Sit down. Do your homework. Please, before you pass out. All right, let's feed Cassin. I never usually put the infants here, but you know what? Let's try it. He's so cute. Look at him. We're gonna give him five food and then we're gonna age him up. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's such a messy eater. He's so cute. Oh my god. It's so cute. All right, let's give him another one. He doesn't like smashed lemon. Let's try pumpkin puree. Oh no, please. Why are you crying? We're just trying to feed you. You were hungry earlier. It's fine. Woof. Gang. Hey, Tulip, it's me, Wolfgang. Do you want to go out on a date? You know, I would love to, Wolfgang. I really would. I really would love to go on a date with you. But we are already pregnant with your child, so I'm good. But maybe next time. There probably won't be a next time, but you know what? No, thanks. All right, let's get back to feeding Cassin. This is his second food. He's so cute, guys. Oh, my God. Oh, he looks like a sweetheart. He likes it. Great. Cassin, you really are a messy eater. Lou. Oh my god, we have two werewolves asking us out on a date. We're gonna say no again because Lou, we already have your child. I don't even know which one is his kid. His kid is in the house right now and I don't know who it is, but no thanks. No thanks, Lou. What's up, Tulip? One of my friends heard about how great you are and has been asking to meet you. Can I give them your number? Yes. Last food to give Cassin and then we are going to age him up. I feel like a lot of my kids are not doing well so far, so after we age up Cassid. We're gonna check on all the other kids. All right. So that was five in total. Let's get the cake out. Happy birthday, Kaisen. We are going to age you up. How is it Noah's birthday already? Did I see that right? It's Noah's birthday. What? I mean, I guess. I don't mind aging him up. All right, Cassin, let's see what you're gonna get. Please, please be independent. Silly. You know what? We'll take it. Not near the water. I don't know where this water came from. Oh, no. She is a wreck. Total wreck, guys. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Oh, my God. I feel like this whole episode, everyone is in a total wreck. I don't know why Paige is here because she does not belong in this house. All right, guys. I am gonna wrap it up here. I feel like a lot of our sims are not on their game right now. Everyone's a total wreck. You can tell by tulip already if you guys enjoy the video don't forget to like comment subscribe turn on notifications so that way you never miss a video and i'll see you guys in the next video